Marta, and Ace, a family of three from Midwest USA. Join us as we tackle being first-time parents, vloggers, and full-time travelers. So far, we've vlogged our way through Thailand, Cambodia, and now Vietnam, traveling south to north. Come on, guys. So today we are in Hanoi. We've been here a few days. We're gonna go out, get some coffee, play with Ace at the park. Uh, we're excited to take you along, show you what a day here is like for us. So we're here to see what the hype is all about. Thank you. We're here at Time Coffee. It's in our neighborhood. Trying coconut coffee for the first time. <laughs> Passed this place a bunch of times and we heard about coconut coffee. But anything coconut flavored, I am a huge fan of. I've heard of the egg coffee, they don't have it here. And we're going to be trying that in a few days when we get to the other side of Hanoi. And I'm also looking forward to that as well. But I feel like this one is going to be a winner. With how many videos we've seen on YouTube of people making here, that there would be tourists and foreigners everywhere. We have not seen any, I mean zero, for five days. Right, what he said. today. Yeah, he's extra talkative today. He is officially 14 months. Officially 14 months and full months. Ace, you ready to go to the park, man? We have made it to the park. Time to burn some of this boy's energy. One of the most amazing things I've ever had in my whole life. It's so good. They just use like a little coconut cream, it seems like in there. And it was about 45,000 Vietnamese dong. So, a little pricey, but worth it. Here you go, baby. Thank you. What do you think? Better than a caramel frappuccino? This tastes like a frappuccino. I don't taste the coconut. Am I crazy? You got to mix it in. I see the coconut, but I don't taste the coconut. <laughs> now all we got to do is keep these things away from Ace, or he'll never run out of energy. This tastes like a frappuccino. <laughs> I don't taste the coconut. It's it's because they turned it into like a slushy. But it's so good. It's maybe that's what's giving it its sweetness. It is so good. I don't know if you can see. I mixed in the coconut very well. Look at Ace over here. He thinks he's <laughs> Watering the plants. Things flowing. It's so nice that we can find all these little parks all around. Um, Asia, you know, we've been able to find it, find little parks and little neighborhoods that we've been staying at, and honestly, they've kept Ace very busy and kept Ace very happy. The only issue now is that he's able to recognize parks. Hi, Ace. Hanoi has been a lot better experience than Nha Trang. The beauty in Nha Trang was that it was next to the water. And we were surrounded by food, but being in Hanoi has just been a lot nicer because you could tell more people are accustomed to seeing tourists and travelers. <laughs> yeah, the vibe here seems to be way more chill. The neighborhood that we're in, it seems to be super family friendly. I mean, there's tons of families, tons of kids, and um, yeah, we're enjoying it. We like it. This is the kind of neighborhood I would like to live in if we were to stay in this part of the world.
can't be in, you know, it's stomp your feet. <laughs> you can't go down with your feet. Ready, set, and go! <laughs> I love this coconut coffee. <laughs> it's so good. I thought I only liked bubble tea, but this coconut coffee is so good. Especially you let this thing sit in the sun for two, three minutes. <laughs> Ace, Ace is about to risk it all. Almost gave us a heart attack. One thing I really enjoy about this neighborhood is that when I was a kid, we would just go out on our bikes and ride around the neighborhoods and play in the woods and just be free. And uh, back in the States, it seems like kids don't really do that as much, but here the kids are just running around, riding their bikes in the streets, you know, even even small little kids, and it's cool to see. Oh! <laughs> Only a few kicks later. <laughs> Cut kicks to the back of the head. Right. <laughs> What's your name? Uh, Fun. Fun and my name is Fun. Fun. It's nice to meet you guys. Yeah. We'll put you guys in the video. <laughs> so thanks for coming and talking to us. In every place that we've been in Vietnam. They have these, whether they're on the beach or just in downtown. It's little just exercise equipment for mobility and stretching out. There's no weights, usually no pull-up bars, but if you just want to loosen your arms, your hips, your back up, people are on these all day. It's it's great to see. They, they need more of these back home. If you can translate that for us, that'd be awesome. <laughs> We're gonna do the, the wheel spin. All right, watch Ace. Here's how you do it. Get your arms stretched out. 